All right, for number 10, we're asked to find um, the average speed of this rocket um, from 3.5 seconds to 5.5 seconds after launch, where uh, the height of the rocket is given by um, this expression. So um, to find the speed, that the, that's the rate of change, the, the, the distance or the height that it's, that it's traveling over time. So distance divided by time is going to give us our speed. Um, so what it's asking for here is the average rate of change um, over the interval from 3.5 seconds to 5.5 seconds. And remember, uh, to find average rate of change, that's going to be uh, h of x2 minus h of x1 divided by x2 minus x1, where uh, x1 is, our, is the smallest number on our interval, x2 is the largest number on the interval. Um, all right, so let's plug this in. h of x2, so h of 5.5, is going to be uh, negative 16 times 5.5, squared plus 106 times 5.5 plus 8.5 and then we're going to want to know h of 3.5 so negative 16 times 3.5 squared plus 106 times 3.5 plus 8.5 um, let's plug that into the calculator So we've got uh, negative 16 times 5.5 squared plus 106 times 5.5 plus 8.5. This is going to be equal to 107.5. All right, and then the other one, we've got negative uh, 16 times 3.5 squared plus 106 times 3.5 plus 8.5. This is um, 183.5. All right, so now um, let's take h of x2, that's 107.5, minus h of 3.5, which is 183.5, and divide that by 5.5 minus 3.5. So 107.5 minus 183.5 is going to be uh, negative 76. And we're going to divide that by 2. 5.5 minus 3.5 is 2. So negative 76 uh, divided by 2 is going to be negative 38. And um, this was given to us in feet. Uh, the height is in feet, the time is in seconds. So this is going to be negative 38 feet per second. That's our average rate of change, or uh, in this particular case, average speed uh, over that interval.